Where's my character? There it is. Goldwyn. Let's go. I've been playing a lot of Splunky just in short bursts. And I've been having a lot of days of like, this runs really good, and then it just completely botches at one point, and I just give up. <laughs> Mostly because I've been trying to do weird things, like I've been trying to get the true crown. I've been trying to... Um, basically get like... A key down to the, the ice caves. Stuff like getting, that. Getting used to this game again is going to suck. Oh yeah, it's always really awkward. When you're, when you're first getting back into Splunky. Oh, you did it already. I might have to use the restrooms here. I mean, that was assumed. Ah! Uh, oh! Well, you saved me. <laughs> that Sorry. could have been really bad. I didn't mean for that to happen. I'm still- now I, I haven't played since the last time we've played together, so now I'm like relearning. I thought you played a little bit. No. Oh. Yeah, be right back. Well, bye, Rachel. I kind of want that, to be honest. Don't know if I'll manage it. We'll see as we go. Oh my god, are you kidding me? Get out of here. Get out of my life. Oh my god, are you fucking kidding me? Look at that. Two chests behind that man. Well, not chests, but crates. But you understand what I'm saying. <laughs> Let's go. Too fucking exhausted to do the last little weapons of the model. I mean, that's like completely fair, right? Oh, two for two, baby! No suicide today. Can't stop success. This is gonna be my last row. He is selling rope. Maybe I'll buy rope instead of bombs. But then what kind of red-blooded Canadian would I be? You always have to go for the explosives. Maybe I'll have enough. Maybe I'll be able to get both. Doubtful. Well, dude, if I fucking died right there at the end... That would have been it for me. I'm like, I'm actually considering like blowing up to get up there, but I don't think that I have the capacity. I think we just might have to call it and just hope for the best going forwards. We got the eye in an almost impressive way, so there is that much. Well, you know what? It's not bombs, but it will improve my capa my capacity capacity to live. Capacity is a new one. I'm not sure I've ever heard that one before. Amazing. Ah. Uh, okay. It's fine. Don't worry about it. Nobody, don't get concerned. Nobody concern themselves with the apparatus that is occurring. The apparatus of my own demise will come swift and foolishly. We will all see it happen. You will be there. Like here? <laughs> oh god, that was too close. That was not okay. That should be illegal. I don't like this. 
Now you're asking me to spend too many bombs. Well, okay. Everything that I tried to save dies. In the end, though, the results are still the same. One less elf. Hey, I hate it. This is less than ideal. Hey. Bad gameplay. Bad gameplay. Bad gameplay. Bad gameplay. Bad gameplay. Bad gameplay. What I say? There we go. Oh god, he's coming. Dude, you're fucking on it tonight. You know where I'm gonna be and you know that you're wanting to be there. You know what? Genuine surprise has occurred with that. I don't think I'm gonna make it to the amount of requisite cash. Smello Noid? Mellow Misty. How does it feel to be slightly older? One year closer to the expiration date. Another hour on the clock closer to punching out. It's getting a bit too noir by saying things like that. The day itself was nice? Well, congratulations. I, <laughs> I considered sending you... A Vimeo game of some kind. But I couldn't find one that was on a reasonable price. And I say that knowing that you give a ton of money to me. Um, but I have I have eyes on your wish list now, and one will come at a later date. Be sure of this. As revenge. I expect nothing! Appreciate everything. We didn't die, and that's all that matters. Eh. Okay, you take my money. You would also take my money. Whoa. You have no expectations, you can't be disappointed. Dude, I always say to have, like, extremely low expectations or to think extremely negatively, because if you do, any small positive... <laughs> fuck. <laughs> any small positive will seem that much more... Uh, that much more impressive, right? Like... I know that that's not a great outlook to have, but if you just expect for things to be not good... And then things are pretty okay. It kind of works out. It evens out itself a little bit, you know. You. You fucker. Oh, I'm not getting God again. I got God again! Now we have to wait for Rachel. <laughs> you, you, good timing. I just died. After saying I won't get God again. Monster Hunter Rise comes out in 24 days. I mean, it's like, it's definitely a game. A demo for it comes out again, which is nice. Oh, there's a little plink. I think the, the blink was up higher. Like, uh, near the spiky boys. Up there. I'm not gonna try to find the blink, I'm sorry. Okay, fair enough. 
the demo is getting an update this week with the new monster hunt. Damn, beat me to it. Yeah, it's like Magnum no. Hollow or something, right? I mean, Thank if anything, you. that just made your life easier. I don't know where your body is. Well. <laughs> that was a bit of a rough end to that. My, I'm gonna let y'all know my mind is not in the right state of mind due to tummy. Hi. Oh. <laughs> See ya. It's the opposite of what I wanted. Magnum Molo, indeed, the flagship monster. They did this with World 2 at a hunt with their Gigante after a while. I don't remember anything about the World demos. I might download the demo, I might not. I know that it comes out on a day that I have work. And as it is, I don't want to work tomorrow. Like, my work is effectively killed. Like, I, I'm never- I wasn't- I won't say that I was a person that was like, Huh huh, gotta do well at work. Gotta- gotta be enthusiastic, support the team. But it was like, I would at least help them. If they said, hey, do this, I would go, alright, begrudgingly I will do it and I will get more money. But they have gotten to the point where I just- I've been so thoroughly fucked around by them, I just don't care anymore. Is Rachel a bit sick? Uh... It's questionable. to be on the turkey. Get out of here. It seems to be a, a situation of food has disagreed with her. What are hush puppies? I've, I, I can't think of what that would be. Battered dough balls, but not donut holes. Eh? That's all? Genuine curiosity. Just for some reason, I was interpreting that in my brain as like a... As, as like a... A potato. I am so mad that that did damage to me. Irrevocably upset. Ran I'm back. I'm sorry. No, it's fine. Don't worry about it. My tummy's not happy. Oh, uh, oh. Uh. Was that a moment of genuine concern? Yeah. I was just scared. Oh, you almost died. Oh, I almost died. Oh, oh, spiders. There's so many spiders. Fucking... Bats. Oh, my Find asshole. the thing. The door. I'll I look at that have... picture in a moment. I also have the pot. Okay. To just, you know. Oh. Squish. Hope Rachel's tummy feels better. I mean, would be nice. But that doesn't sound like Rachel's stomach to me. I predict many, many more hours of discomfort. Mm-hmm. You can, 
You can do the smash. Fuck you, ghost. What did she eat? Nachos. Uh, uh. We tried to pick up the same thing. Yeah, I ate nachos and I'm dumb. Oh, that was a boy. Yeah, it's a Kodama. Kind of boy. I'm wanting that to be my next tattoo so bad. I mean, you want a Sudama or whatever they're called. I want both of them, to be honest. Let's be real here. There's a bat. There you go. I was gonna make a joke and say, I'll just get one of those weird lewd tattoos. I'm too fat for that. If I was skinny, like if I was a very skinny girl, 100% I would. If you were an e girl. Uh... Why don't you go this way? He's coming! Here's my question for you in regards to that. Would you would you create your own design or use a pre-designed one? Probably create my own. That's fair enough. I have the boys, so I'm not going anywhere. Also, yes, you are correct about the, uh, the cheese. Oh, there's a spider. Oh, okay. We'll just go up. Kitty! Why do you exist? Because you wanted it to. I know. I'm very happy. I'm just also very irritated. <laughs> With some of the things. I can't throw away bags now. Like, paper bags, because she likes to play in them. And she's doing that right now. She's she's playing. She'll hit the ball into yeah. the bag, go and retrieve the ball, and then hit it back into the bag. She's essentially playing soccer. Why do we exist? Just to suffer. Dude, I'm having a bad day. Me too. No, I, I opened up a, a, a pot and a snake in it, but I did that by hitting another guy, so it was like, ah, I'm not going to take any damage, and then I just took damage anyway. Yeah, I'm gonna die. Stop it. Just, uh, monkey, get off. Yeah, uh. We're going down, down, and all the way around. Is Sugar Bear going? There was no point in me coming down here. <laughs> There's absolutely no point, and I can't get up. I'm it's, stuck it's here. It's fine. Okay. <laughs> mm, water? Yeah. Down, down, water. Have you seen, like, the weird, like, millennial people that are just trying to shit on Gen Z now? No. So, it's like... How all of the, like, baby boomer people would sit there on TV and just go, like, Oh, well, the millennials are ruining things because of X. It's like all these weird millennial moms on, on TikTok sitting there making fun of Gen Z people. And all the responses from Gen Z people are just the best. Because it's just, it's them saying, like, all these millennial people are just grumpy because they didn't get their avocado toast in the morning or shit like that. It's all very dumb, I wanna be honest. Every like all aspects of it are stupid. Oh yeah, no, it's very dumb. But I just I like the idea that I'm at like, the door. Somebody yeah, you can go through. Somebody told like a thirty five year old, Yeah, but now you get to make fun of the youth. And they went, Oh, I'm in. We should be trying to get along, not argue with each other. Not make fun of each other's generations, it's cool. Cause I get to sit back and laugh about it. I don't know. I just I want to uh, I try to just pay my mind my own business and pay attention to my own shit. Cuz I can't be bothered. That man that. hit me so hard he knocked my soul out of my body. Yeah, I was really hoping to get above him. You can throw my body into him.
Well, I'm. St it's that was whole thing was just bad. <laughs> I just stopped. I'm gonna be honest. I just didn't care anymore. <laughs> you neoed it. My stomach hurts. If we fight, the planet gets fucked faster. No offense, but like a 36 year old white woman deciding that she wants to shit on her like niece on TikTok is not making the world any worse. Like, the world's fucked for drastically more consequential problems. Ooh, that's really nice. Ah! He almost killed me. Oh, come He's on. He's not happy with existence right now. But it's not helping, but it's not hurting, either. Like, it's... This is what I mean. Like, I understand where you're coming from, because you're coming from a really altruistic idea. Of, like, Literally, people need the, to get along. But I'm, the, like... The, People should make fun of each other, too. The only negative about anything that's happening is, um, it's cringy. That's it. Yeah, it's it's cringe culture, but I, it, I'm it's here very, for it. It's very... It's so cringe. Like, I'm there's... dead. I'm dead. I'm gonna die. Oh, I tried to save the squirrel, the chipmunk. Are you stuck in the bag? <laughs> Get in the bag, the void bag. Babes! <laughs> I have to go save her. She's actually, she's wearing like a turtle shell. <laughs> oh, she got out. Babes! What are you doing? Oh, my tummy. Wearing it like a turtle shell. She had, so it's like a, like a, like a square paper bag with two little handles, and she had the two little handles looped over her shoulders, and the bag was on her back. She looked like a little turtle. You having fun with my bag? Oh, I mean, it will obviously turn into genuine arguments, but that's that's my point. It's like, it's gonna be a 36-year-old white woman who's just like, but what if I got to, like, shit on my, my niece on, on TikTok? And then it's gonna turn into real family arguments. But that's what I love about it, because I know that deep down, somebody's gonna take generational differences way too seriously, and it will be extremely funny. Eh! Well, that man killed you instead of me somehow. Well, now he's killed me as well. <laughs> I don't even understand how he flew backwards like that. <laughs> <laughs> Misty, I think that you're 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 prone to calamitizing things a little bit. Uh, the world doesn't die because generations decide to mock each other. The world dies because no. humans like to get like really really violent. And that doesn't happen dies. from that doesn't happen from older people making fun of the youth. That happens because people hate each other. Hey, you bastard. And also because people like me exist but they're not self-aware. Um, yeah. Oh, I'm stuck here, actually. Um, cool. The world dies. Actually, I can get out. The world dies because people are just dumb. Arguing doesn't do anything. And that's the thing. It doesn't do any good and doesn't do any bad. It just is exists and it's a waste of time and effort. Ow. It can do both good and bad. And ultimately speaking, if the bad is you don't like your grandmother on you know, the internet, because it's cringe. That's just, that's neutral. It doesn't do anything. It's just cringe. Billionaires don't care enough? Yeah, but I mean, if you, if you subtract billionaires from the equation, then it just becomes, well, kings didn't care. Humans are just really bad for caring about other people. And I mean, that comes from me, who doesn't care about other Oh. I got crushed. Wow, we're just not doing well. Okay. You move. <laughs> I'm gonna focus. Activating the Spelunky gene. Oh, really? But yeah, that's what I mean when I say, like, people like myself just aren't self-aware. Because a lot of people are, like, really, like psychopathic or sociopathic where they just they don't have the empathy but they're not aware of the fact that they don't have the empathy so they just act like shitters Ooh. I wish I could get that but I would have to commit a violence for it 
And I don't have the faith that I could get us out of that without <laughs> one of us dying. What do you want? He has a jetpack, but it's 20k. Get fucked, fat man. Oh, hi, Yang. I don't want the turkey. I want the arrow. Arrow. <gasps> oh, 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 oh. One of the worst television shows I ever watched. So is Supergirl. Winx Club's really bad. Winx Club is really bad for a lot of reasons, but here's the thing. It's really fucking funny. Like, there's something extremely funny about being like, I'm a plant fairy, I can grow plants, I use it to grow weed. So the other college students won't hate me. I have the key. The live action one or the cartoon? Both are pretty bad in my opinion. And also the cartoon one changed style like three times and became a 3D CGI show at some point, which is extremely weird. Oh my god, my stomach. Can I just fucking suck? Uh. They, uh, it was an Italian show, wasn't it? That's why everything's like weird about it. Sort of, but not like why it's weird. Like it's it's weird because it's a European trying to make a. Uh, like, I would say American-style television show that... Oof. Okay, my, my Spelunky gene did not kick in. I'm dead. Um, but it is... It's like a... It, it's like a European show that's trying to be American, that's trying to be Japanese. Because it was doing all of the usual bullshit that you would get with magical girl shows, right? You died already. Um, yeah. There was a pot that had a scorpion, then there was another pot that had another scorpion. Yeah, we're just gonna restart that one, then. This is, this is bad all around. Also, I don't know what Red posted. I don't, I don't look there that often. But, uh, like, the, the Winx Club tried to do Western Magical Girl, and I guess it kind of worked, but... I think that the superior Western magical girl show about, I, like, I know they're fairies or pixies or whatever the fuck they are, um, but I think the superior show in that vein was Witch, where they weren't witches either, but their initials all spelled the word Witch. Or I did the redeem. Listen, <laughs> I see them. I can't, uh, I can't stretch and do a posture check, I say, lying through my teeth. Hey, I'm dead again. <laughs> Alright. I here's the thing. I actually play fine on my own. So I'm not sure why I'm suddenly really bad. Probably because you know I'm not trying to I'm not attempting to do well. Yeah, but that should be more impetus for me to do well. I'm just here for a good time. Yeah, but I mean if you're just dying, it's it, not gonna it, it's it's really hard to concentrate when your stomach just keeps going. Go to the washroom again. I um, it's not like I have to like use the bathroom. It's that my insides are slowly rotting. I don't think that that's accurate. <sighs> but yeah, there's there was a show called Witch that I remember, and I don't remember it being good, but I remember it, and I remember it being better than Winx Club. Which, again, isn't saying much. 
but still. Ipecac? I mean, it's a good item, but honestly overrated. I could go for playing Isaac again at some point. Honestly, I, I feel... Witch Hunter Robin is a show I bring up every couple of months. Like, there's somebody that I will mention that show to every time. I don't know why. It just always pops into my brain. It's a good show. I'm pretty sure it has Crispin Freeman in it. Who did you anger? Uh, I angered a shopman. Because in my brain, I was like, Rachel's probably going to be long enough that I can uh, get to safety. <laughs> well, because here's the thing. If you don't kill them, and then you don't attack them on the next floor, you, they just let you go. It's like if you commit the big hate crimes and then you just don't do that for a long enough period of time, people just forgive you. If I can get a fact check, is Crispin Freeman in Witch Hunter Robin? I think that like he's one of my favorite voice actors, but he's also one of the, my like most hated voice actors. Because I think he's great. And everything that he voice acts in is, is fantastic. But he's one of those guys that has one voice. Like as much as I hate Yuri Lowenthal, at least Yuri Lowenthal doesn't always sound like Yuri Lowenthal. Oh god, it's it's a fucking tunnel in here. Why I like this. Okay. Back with my water? Oh, welcome back. Uh, you're going to want to watch out. Okay. Because there will be an angry shaman at the bottom. And I'm trying to avoid killing him. Oh, that turkey died. Perfect. We're just going to do full chaos? Oh, no. Not at all. My plan is that if I... Uh, my plan is that if I... If I can... I can uh, get the the shopkeepers to forgive us next turn, like next area. I just, I can't hit him or else he'll stay angry for another floor. Okay, hold on. Please shoot out that skeleton wall. Well, I didn't want you to shoot Rachel. That was why I wanted you to be safe. Here. Wait. Okay. My bad. Oh. might not be de after all, because I forgot this floor exists. But usually if you just, if you aggro a shoppy on one floor and you don't hurt them the next, they just forgive you, but I think it doesn't necessarily carry over if you have to go to this one.
Oh my god. What happened? Um, just poor choices. I got me. You handle you. Oh. That's why I'm stuttering downloading it. Ah. Oh. 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 Come on. <laughs> I was doing so well, and then she comes back. It's not my fault. I'm not saying it is. I'm just saying. I was doing well. The way well. you worded it, it sounded like, oh, she came back, and I did bad. Well, I guess I'm here now. There is no shot man, however. Bad area. Might die. Nope. Duh. Squish. <laughs> Lady Luck comes back. I mean, there is something to be said about characters who, oh. There's something to be said about characters who are like anti-luck devices. Ooh. It's the ghost pot! <laughs> oh, I'm in fire. It's hot. That's less good. <laughs> I'm not that superstitious ghosts, though they're real. I would personally like a world where if I could Prove it, supernatural things did not exist. Or alternatively, we're controllable in some facet. Well, that's just me. I would definitely be the guy who is like... Cool, let me control ghosts. What do you mean they hate it? I don't care, they're dead. What? I know it's bedtime. Soon. That's what I'm saying, is if the supernatural exists, I need to have control. If the supernatural is allowed to run around willy-nilly and be fucking terrible, I hate it. Soon. There's, there's some bombs up there if you want them. Soon. Yeah, I might want them. like that. Okay, don't shoot in that direction. I just hope my tummy is better by tomorrow because I want to go get the Animal Crossing thing. I figured you'd just order it online. Uh, I'm gonna see if I can get it at the Ulta in the mall. And then if I can't, then yeah, I'm gonna order it offline. Power of gun. Ding. Oh. Oh. <laughs> oh. There's just a lot of death. Oh. Oh. Yeah, is there? Um. This got me. Yeah, I can see that. Yeah. Hold on. I got him. I mean, I'm not gonna fight him. Oh. Because there's a door right here. Oh. Okay. If the supernatural exists, I want to be able to hang out with a werewolf. That'd be rad. Except it wouldn't be when they start trying to kill you. 
I believe the supernatural exists, but not like... Not like... Werewolves and trolls and shit. It's like, I believe ghosts exist. But why? Just, I don't, just do. Not like why you believe ghosts exist, but more like, if those exist, then how come a more supernatural entity that's like... Traditional. I have, so. I have like, I have like a better understanding of... This is, this is fucked, so hold on. Yeah. I have... Well, uh... I didn't expect it to chomp the bomb like that, but, uh, hey, you can uh, leave now. Uh, uh, hey. I don't, I want the gun! I want the gun! Well, the gun's on the uh, other side now. Fuck it. it I can't down. go in, I can't go inside. I'm just gonna die. There's no point. You literally could have just waited until it walked out of the way. I tried when it wasn't in the way and it wouldn't let me. It has to be enough out of the way. I'd make the sex. I think. Ever. I think. I don't like. That. I think. I think this is a I watch you play and I'm done playing. <laughs> well, I mean, if you're done playing, then I might just switch games. Switch games because my stomach is just real fucked right now. Like I'll do one run, and that's it. Um, but I have. I think it's easier to think of like easier to picture rather, like the energy of a human not going anywhere when they die and it just sort of stays there then a man can turn into a wolf when the full moon arises you know what i mean oh yeah no i like, understand that because i don't think like oh someone was so wrathful that their spirit lingered to kill like no it's like i just think like if something bad enough happens the energy stays I don't believe in the whole like the crystals will help. It's like they're rocks. Stop. <laughs> okay, he's dead. I mean, my manager carries around a small bag of crystals in her purse. I believe that it has an effect on people. Whether that effect is entirely a, from their own mind or not is another I was gonna say thing. It's a, it's a placebo effect. If you think this rock is going to help you, this rock will help you. It's kind of like the, I literally, like, a, like, equivalent to the Pirates of the Caribbean jar of dirt thing. Where it's just like, this jar of dirt could help you. Technically speaking, if you believe it'll help you, it'll help you. But everybody else on the outside's like, that's fucking dumb. Wait, was there not, like, any plot to that? It's supposed to be like, J.V. Jones can't, like, touch Earth. He can't, like, walk on shore, and so it's, like, carry around the jar of dirt. That's all time. that was? I thought it was, like, yeah. inside of it they had his heart or something. No, uh, he hides the heart in the jar of dirt at one point. Okay, so, but, like, but that's what I mean, is, like, it does get use. It's not just... Yeah, but it's, the original... It's not just stew. But, but the original thing for the jar of dirt was, oh, he can't walk on Earth, so you carry Earth with you. That's like anti-vampire logic. Oh, they can't cross the ocean, so they have to go in a coffin. Yeah, that's why it's kind of like... <laughs> that's what I'm saying, like, crystals are the same thing when people carry around the gold, like... And, and I guess, I guess I chalk it up to, like... I don't... Also, I don't, Misty, watch like, the ghost stories dub. It's like, it's like carrying around a rosary, but you're in Japan, you know? It's like, <laughs> <laughs> it's like that ghost isn't Christian. That ghost isn't going to give a shit. Well, th what's especially funny to me about that is the persecution of the Christians when they first arrived in Japan. And they were just like, oh, so you don't want to besmirch the face of Jesus. That's correct. Cool. Step on the crucifix for me. Why? Do it or I'll kill you. Okay, and then they just did it. And it was like, why do you think Jesus would be mad that you stepped on him, dude? Like, <laughs> I it's just... so, it's like, if you, if you had to say to Jesus, dude, it's my life or I step on a statue of you. The actual man, Jesus, would totally be like, dude, why are you even asking me that question? And it's I... also like when people, my, it's also like when people um are like, uh, there was a quote I read where it's like if Jesus was walking, if Jesus came back today, like the Christians that supposedly follow the faith would <laughs> totally like press like uh 
like arrest him or whatever. Oh yeah, no. Here's him. the thing. I, I <laughs> like he was literally arrested by his own people in the past. It would be nothing new to him. Yeah, it's just like I always like the but I always love the Jesus is a brown man thing. It's like it's like do you really think that just Mary He's at least just tam. It's like Mary and Joseph just popped out a blonde hair, blue eyed baby in the middle of Jerusalem. Like, you think? No, that's not how that works. Like, it's not impossible, but, like, he would at least still have a tan complexion. He's in the desert. Jesus would hate Christianity? Oh, 100%. Mostly because he wanted to reform Judaism. Mm -hmm. But you can't control what happens to your faiths after you die. All religions, though. And I, I always say this because I know Christianity is the one that gets the shit kicked out of it the most, which annoys me just due to me. I don't say I'm Christian, but it's like I believe in the faith. I mean, if it makes you feel any better, I also shit on Buddhism a lot. It's just... But, like, no, no, no. Yeah, but you're you. You're yeah. the one person. I'm saying as a whole, most people shit on Christians. And it sucks, but it's like, I'm also like, well, I shit on the quote unquote Christians because they're not doing what the Bible tells you to do. Like, I had a discussion with my fucking dad the other day, <gasps> where it's like, I'm like, does he... <sighs> you brought up something from the Old Testament. I'm just like, you didn't realize that the New Testament came around because God went, Old Testament? Don't follow it no more, it's stupid. Here's the New Testament, follow this one. I'm like, so you can't pick and choose what rules you want to follow. <laughs> the problem is like, that's the definition of every church picking and choosing the rules you want to follow like and then I also hate the my parents f like firmly believe he don't follow the um, King James Bible yeah we've had that hell. discussion a lot which is extremely funny I'm like so you you really think that God would punish so that's the Pope <laughs> like you really think God would punish <sighs> I'm alive. Um, a bunch of people because they don't follow a Bible that was translated by some white man. It's not even the uh, white man thing that's the problem. It's just translated by think. a dude. He was just, yeah, he was just, a, yeah, but he wanted, like, what, how can I use this to control people? Gonna make Jesus look like my son and gonna. <laughs> <laughs> there's a and... lot of, there's a lot of theory actually. Because I, as a person that I am, you know, weird about religion, but, like, in the sense of I want to learn all the weird shit, there's a lot of, di like, actual real discussion about who white Jesus is based on. And so one of the... Is King James's son? Well, one of the current theories, because white Jesus was a thing forever, right? Uh, like, ever since it was brought into major Christendom, uh, like... The, the one of the ideas was that it was Cesare Borgia, which is extremely fucking funny. I'm fucking dead. That's my run. Um...